appreciate you taking the time uh, this afternoon to just give us a few minutes to talk about some of big highlights of your career and what you have coming up. And a lot of us are excited for this sophomore album and uh, we'll uh, touch on this and hopefully get an idea of when you plan on putting it out. But uh, first thing I want to start off with is the other, um, last week it was, you actually got the honor of opening up the BET Hip Hop Awards with a powerful message, mm -hmm. amazing, amazing freestyle song, whatever you want to, you know, count it as. How did it feel yeah. when they came to you and asked you to do something like that? I know it's tight. When they asked me, you know, to, uh, to open up the awards, I was like, dope. And, you know, they kind of told me what they wanted me to talk about. So, you know, just pin some spoken word things, and I felt like it was good. It was definitely a good look. It was definitely awesome to see you get the honor of that and then to give somebody like you, you know, up and coming, soon to be a great, the honor of doing that, especially like uh, yeah. nowadays, it's, it's definitely really cool to do. And it made me think back on like the whole like uh, freshman class of last year and how many mm -hmm. stars have really come from that. Like, is there anybody in particular that you really still kind of keep in touch with from that class? Yeah, I keep in touch with... um. Yeah, a couple of those folks. Gunna, for sure. And, um, yeah, it's a lot of talent on that class, for sure. Yeah, I think it's probably a lot of talent. arguably one of the probably best freshman classes of all time since they've been doing it. I would think. Yeah, for sure. I think it's too early to say that. We'll see, like, five to ten years from now, really. You know what I'm right. saying? But for sure. Yeah, I definitely, definitely agree. Um, So – I was looking at your Instagram story just a little bit ago. Noticed that you got gifted the new Xbox Series X. Mm -hmm. Have you had a chance to fire it up yet? No, I haven't. Yeah. Um, I have not. Have you always been more Xbox than PlayStation, or does it really not no, matter for you? I'm more PlayStation, actually, than Xbox. I got the P5, too. I got that, like, last week. <laughs> Lucky. <laughs> right, exactly. That's awesome right there. Um. All right, so... The new song, Gifted, I take it it's going to be on the upcoming project, your sophomore album that you're working on? I don't know. I don't know if it's going to make the album. I don't know yet. I just know it's a, um, you know, for the time being, it's definitely like a great song. You know what I'm saying? But I just got to see how it fits in with the whole album as a whole. You know what I'm saying? With the body of work. But I'm not sure. Okay. Um, with that song, you and Roddy Rich amazing i love how you guys go back and forth on it was that something you went into into the session thinking you were going to do go back and forth with them or did that just kind of happen it just kind of happened yeah that wasn't the vibe you know what i'm saying i was kind of going through records that like i had open verse and then i was just like let's just make some uh something from scratch so we did that does that kind of remind me of like you know mid 2000s early 2000s when you hear a lot of rappers kind of going back and forth it's not something you really hear so much nowadays and it sounded really really good so uh definitely yeah. say that you know no nah, for sure definitely now the you are definitely working on the sophomore album correct yes sir absolutely yeah you have any idea of when that's going to be coming out should i hope next year sometime Okay, now in the recording process for this one, what would you say is uh, different this time around than when you uh, did the Lost Boy? Probably just living more with the music, man, taking my time. Actually, I was taking my time a lot with that, but uh, shit, quarantine, bro. Like, quarantine, that's it. Everything. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Quarantine, for sure. Would you kind of say that quarantine maybe was a gift when it comes to making music for you? Like, it gave you more chance to really focus and uh zone in on it yeah i guess you can definitely say that for sure you can definitely say that because you know you would have been out touring all over the country like nonstop this past year yeah absolutely so yeah definitely no nah, it definitely gave me that for sure right um all right man so uh definitely looking forward to the upcoming project hopefully we get that sooner than later early next year that'd be great um absolutely. the song is gifted which everybody is loving, stream Thank it up you. more. Um, but last question for you before I let you go, because I know you're running through a whole bunch of these with a whole bunch of different radio stations and everything today. Oh, and good. Ask this to like everybody that comes through here is if you had a fake pair of Yeezys and you got Kanye to sign them, would they be real Yeezys? Yes. 
because they're this real. is what author it. Like, make it official. Yeah, like, bro, Kanye signed them. What are you talking? Mine are realer than yours. The nigga who <laughs> created the shoe signed them. They're realer than yours. Yes, absolutely. Nice. Well, I appreciate that, man. Thanks for answering question and everything this afternoon. Definitely uh, look forward to hearing some more new music from you. Loving what you've been putting out. Definitely, you know, continue on. Much success to you. The BET Hip Hop Awards opener was amazing. So definitely, man, just really ruined for you here. Absolutely. Thank you so much, man. Appreciate all the love you've been showing, you know, throughout my journey, bro. It doesn't go unnoticed and I don't take it for granted at all. So I just appreciate the love, bro. Thank you. Awesome, Corday. Thank you very much, man. I appreciate it and definitely have a good rest of your day. All right, you too, bro. Absolutely. Thank you, man. Later. Yeah.